Ethical dilemmas can arise when the pursuit of knowledge clashes with the well-being of those involved. Let's delve into a few fictionalized scenarios inspired by real-life cases. Scenario 1. The Little Albert Experiment In the early 20th century, a baby named Little Albert was conditioned to fear a white rat through repeated pairing with a loud, startling noise. This fear then extended to other white, furry objects. While the study provided insights into classical conditioning, it's now widely criticized for its unethical treatment of the child. Is it ethical to intentionally create fear or distress in a child, even if it advances scientific understanding? Scenario 2. The Facebook Emotional Contagion Study In 2014, Facebook, now known as Meta, conducted a study where they manipulated the emotional content of users' news feeds without their knowledge or consent. Some users were shown more positive posts, while others were shown more negative posts. The study aimed to see if exposure to different emotional content could influence users' own emotions, a phenomenon called emotional contagion. Is it acceptable for companies to conduct psychological experiments on users without their explicit consent? Scenario 3. The Asian Prison Drug Trial Imagine a prison housing individuals convicted of major drug trafficking offenses. A pharmaceutical company proposes a clinical trial for a new drug aimed at reducing drug cravings and aiding rehabilitation. Participation in the trial is mandatory for all inmates with the stated goal of improving their well-being and reducing recidivism upon release. Is it ethical to use a captive population like prisoners for drug trials? These scenarios highlight the importance of ethical considerations in research.